Hi and welcome to my channel. I'm Jaya and I'm a very, very, very brand new, little, little, excited little, as you can see, new, new booktuber. So I'm going to do today the booktube new to newbie challenge and I want to invite you, if you are a new booktuber, to also do the booktube newbie challenge. So what is this challenge? This challenge is basically for people to tell who they are and why they started this channel etc and also to meet new booktubers and to be discovered by other readers or other booktubers. So without any further ado here goes. So the very first question is why did I start this channel? I, I love talking about books. For the past few years I'm trying to be more mindful about reading more diverse books although I've been reading forever it's only recently that I've started planning and tracking my reading and trying to be more diverse. And of course, diversity is such a broad subject and there are many, many ways to be diverse. And I'm excited to recommend, but also learn and expand the scope of diversity within my own reading list and for everyone else who follows and loves books all over the world. Next question. Okay, so the next question is, what are some fun or unique things I can bring to booktube? I mean, I think everyone, um, including me, brings their own unique perspective to booktube. I curate my own reading lists and I will share thoughts on the ones that I read. Um, occasionally, something that only I can do is share my own original book cover art. Um, it's something that I am just dabbling in and learning and I'm very, very new to digital art, just like I'm very new to um, booktubing or YouTubing in general. So yeah, I hope that all these things would be interesting and fun for people to read. Um, I also read a lot of international literature from all around the world. I'm trying to read books from countries that aren't usually read or aren't usually discussed in the mainstream. So yeah, I hope that's also something that's new and would introduce some of you at least to some new books that you may not have heard of or that you may have wanted to read but may not have explored. Next. What am I most excited for, for this new channel? Um, the prospect of finding book nerds and sharing my love for reading for you all, with you all is honestly the most exciting part about starting this channel. Um, apart from giving me the opportunity to read more and connect with more readers, um, I also hope that I will learn something and I hope I can share it with you all. Why do I love reading? I mean, I just love stories. Um, stories help me feel, at least for a little while, that I'm in somebody else's shoes and I get concerned about their problems, excited about their romances and share their joys and sorrows. Books allow me to get to know so many different people with so many different characteristics, different needs, lives, the choices they make, etc. from all over the world. It really, really opens my mind. And it's like traveling from the comfort of your home. I know it's like a little bit cliche, but that's how I feel. I feel like the experience of reading is unparalleled because it spins such a beautiful web um, and it's such an amalgamation of your own imagination as well as author's words and perspectives. So, you know, that every book is unique in every single person's head. And that's something that I think no other media can offer. And that's what I love the most about reading. What book or series got me into reading? Honestly, I think I've been reading for pleasure ever since I knew how to read and like as far back as I can remember in my childhood I have been reading. Um, I think my school teachers still remember me uh, from over 10 years or 15 years ago as that little girl with her hair falling down who would just sit and read in the library. So and my school had one of the best libraries a child could want. It was stocked 
with books in English for children of all ages. So I grew up reading, you know, Enid Blyton and Ruskin Bond and Roald Dahl and R.L. Stein and Judy Bloom and Sweet Valley Twins and so many other authors. Um, I had constant access to great books and teachers who would encourage reading. I think that's what really got me into reading. And it's just a habit that has stayed with me through my childhood, through my other life. No matter what has changed in my life, reading has stuck with me forever. And yeah, uh, I mean, I've been in love with reading forever. It's like a constant crush. Um, what questions would I like to ask my favorite booktubers? Well, actually, I think I haven't even scratched the surface of booktubing. Uh, for the mo for like, I've got into the scene very, very recently. And for most of my life, I've viewed reading as a solitary activity. And I've just been happy to sit in a corner and read books and discover books at my own pace. Um, but this earlier this year, or I think it was December of 2019, when I discovered the Reading Women Challenge and from there the Reading Women Podcast. And now I look forward to listening to Kenra Sachi Samaya and the entire team from the Reading Women Podcast every single Wednesday. I think if I met them, I would honestly just like <laughs> gush and fangirl. But, um, <laughs> but like the real thing, I mean, I think what I would ask them are things like what inspires them to continue like reading and uh, recommending and also how they plan their reading lists and themes because honestly they are amazing and I've never been disappointed by any book that has been recommended by them. So yeah, I think that's it. And obviously I think I have a long way to go and I'm still figuring out like what booktube is and who I want to read and who I want to listen to. So, I mean, ask that question to me in two years' time and then I'll tell you more. Okay, I think last question. Exciting. What challenges do you think um, of starting a book club, booktube channel, sorry, would be the hardest to overcome? I mean, I love reading, but I'm so new to this whole social reading, uh, I don't know, process. So... I think like for me, planning books in advance, taking notes, making reviews, and then making videos and editing them, etc. Like I think all of this requires so much work. And while I can do it now, I'm not sure if I'll be able to sustain it or I'll be motivated to, sus motivated to sustain it. So I think, yeah, that's my biggest challenge that I'm, I'm so new to it. And I just started a channel and I hope that I can continue doing it. One last bonus question that's not in this tag, but I do want to address is this. What am I reading right now? So right now I am one third of the way or less than a third of the way in uh, on the JCB Prize 2020 long list. Um, one of the things that I noticed in my own reading is that I lack reading Indian literature a lot. I mean, maybe I've read some Indian books by some very famous or established authors, but it's not like something that is on my list a lot or it's not something that I used to seek out a lot. So when the JCB Price long list was announced, I just decided that I want to read all of them. Um, so I have already read Jin Patrol on Jin Patrol on the Purple Line, and I've also read In Search of Here, which I absolutely loved. Like I absolutely loved both of those books, and they were fantastic. And the third book that I'm reading right now is Mustache by S. Harish. I'm going to send. I'm going to put down a link of the JCP Price long list in. The description be sure to check them out they all look fantastic honestly and i can't wait to read all of them i will be reviewing them for this booktube channel hopefully um yeah 
that's it i'm reading that now please tell me what you are reading right now in comments below and what type of content do you want to see from me etc and also tell me what brought you to this channel and if you are a booktube newbie don't forget to make a video and tag yourself as a booktube newbie and answer the questions that i have also put in the description below one last thing i have been posting some reviews as well as my original art on my instagram page which is at the creative universe of jaya so please do check it out and follow me for more regular content i promise i'll be more regular on instagram than i am on youtube where i will try to post at least once a week okay thank you so much for watching bye bye